Okay, this is early in the football game. We felt like uh, we were going to get a lot of man coverage. So we had a little, what we call formation into the boundary. Uh, we bring a, a kind of a decoy receiver in motion to tr try to pull another defender out. You can see him right there, number 20, 29. He ends up coming across the formation with Chris James, which uh, ends up breaking this inside zone run. Uh, so we, we, we ended up with one less defender where we wanted to run the football. Owen did a great job of covering those guys up. Lim maybe uh, did a great job making a guy miss there at the end. Uh, right here, it's a really good job by Reggie Anderson. Uh, we practiced this uh, multiple times throughout the week. Uh, and he did a great job of just executing. Really, everybody on the field did a great job of just executing this play. He does a great job of catching the ball, running through the catch, um, you know, breaking a tackle, and then accelerating to the end zone. So I was really, really proud of him and, and how he played, and especially on this play, uh, really jump-starting our offense and getting to the end zone right here. All right, this is one of our bread and butter runs. We kind of live and, live and die by what we call outside zone play or a wide zone play. Uh, and Lim is you know, fantastic at it, obviously. Uh, makes a good run. We miss the backside. Backside's hard to get on it. We missed that block, but he, again, he ends up breaking that tackle and getting us down here in field goal range. Aaron's been, been great for us, by the way. Uh, he was three for three in the game, but he's, he's almost automatic. I think he leads the country, actually, in field goal percentage right now. Uh, this is the same, same play we ran earlier. It's an outside zone play. This time we get the offensive line does a great job and gets the backside cut off and Lim doesn't have to break that tackle. It's a perfect view of it right here. You can see guys on the ground on the backside, which is kind of key to that play. And uh, receiver does a good job of staying on his block and we leave one-on-one uh, -on -one with the safety who's the deepest player. Just again, I want to commend Aaron on, on what he's done for our team uh, up to this point. He, he's been extremely clutch for us. Uh, going into this play right here, uh, Kanori just does a great job of, of making a, a big, big play right here. If you slow it down for me, um, you know, he, he, it's a big catch. Uh, late in the game, does a great job of, of making that play. This is, this is uh, really the drive we needed to have a chance to win the football game. When we got down here, it's third and goal from the two. This is, you, you've heard people talk about RPOs. That's what this is. It's a run pass option. Cole's got the ability to hand the ball off there to the limb based on what the defense does. They, they tackle the limb. He comes out looking for the pass and they cover the pass too. And the third option is him just keeping the ball. And it, this play was great. Everybody thought the back was tackled. The crowd went nuts. And, us as coaches knew all along, Cole had it in his hip pocket and he was just going to walk in the end zone. So it ended up being a great, great play by him.